In this video, I am going to explain how to create a basic interface of a shopping cart using jQuery UI Droppable. So, this is the basic droppable option which will allow you to drop an element inside another HTML element. So, with this, we are going to create a basic shopping cart interface. So, first we need to have jQuery UI files. We have already explained how to download and reference jQuery UI files in our HTML document. So, I am not going to explain it again. I have created a basic HTML5 file and I have added reference to the jQuery UI and jQuery files. This is the jQuery UI.css file and this is the jQuery UI.js file and this is the jQuery.js file. Now we need to have a list of items which we will add to our shopping cart. So for that let me create a list of items h2 items I am going to make this an jQuery UI accordion in fact you can create just a list of items but for more clarity I am making it a accordion it is so easy to create an jQuery UI accordion let me create a div div and I am providing an ID let the ID be my accordion and I am going to add the items. As this is just for a demo purpose, I am adding h3 books as a list. I am going to add book 1, book 2. Let me copy and paste it to create a couple more books. Let this be book 3 and let this be book 4. Again similarly let me add a set of toys as well. This is toys. Toy 1. Toy 2 and toy 3. Let me delete this. Okay. Now we have a list of items and what we next need we need to have a place as a shopping cart so that we can drag these items that we want to purchase into our shopping cart so for that let me add another section div id equal to say cart okay let me provide a heading over here h2 shopping cart and I am adding an ordered list with an ID, let it be items, so that we will be adding the dragged items as an ordered list of items. So this is the ordered list. Let me save this file. Okay. Now if we open it, I have saved it in this folder, shopping cart. Let me open it with Google Chrome. But we will get we will just get a list of items and also a shopping cart to make it more clear let me first make this my accordion actually an accordion so how will we do it it is so easy to create a jquery ui accordion actually for that let me add the script okay dollar document dot ready we have also discussed how to write the jQuery code easily in another video. You can see that video to understand how easy it is to write the jQuery code. So here inside this function, first I am going to make this an accordion. So dollar we need to access it using its id so hash my accordion dot we need to add the accordion method so that 
this will become an accordion now if you check this thing see this has become an accordion if you click this the other thing will be closed and you will see the list of items and if you click this this section will be closed and you will see this books list now this has become an accordion but this is expanded all over the web page so what we can do we can set the width of this accordion and also make this look like a shopping cart for that we need to add some CSS code so here after the script section we can add style okay we need to style the accordion first for that let me set the width let it be say 300 px and also height 400 px and let us make it float left and let me also add margin say 25 px okay next we need to make this look like a shopping cart so let me set width and height for that also hash cart let the width be 3 or uh, 200 px let the height be say 400 px and let us set some border 2 px solid black okay now let's check how it appears refresh okay the width is too small i think let me change this to 400 px and let the width also be 400 px okay now we are what we have done we have styled the accordion and also the shopping cart div element and now it appears like this okay now what we want to do we want to make these items draggable so that we can drag these items into this shopping cart in fact you can style these elements the way you want I am just making it the basic shopping cart implementation or the interface. So here first we need to make these items draggable. For that I am going to create a class name for these items. So let me make this source because these are the source elements that need to be dragged this also class equal to source otherwise we need to create a class name for each of this li element and make them draggable instead of that what i am going to do is dollar dot source li so that this will become dollar source is this unordered list and li means these individual items so instead of adding a class name to each of these items i have added class name commonly to the unordered list and specified dot source li dot draggable so that these items will be now draggable let us check it refresh okay i have made a mistake here it should be within double quotes that is why it displayed wrongly so now refresh see now let us try to drag these items see we are able to drag it but what happens here a scroll bar is appearing when we try to drag it over here so to avoid that what we can do is we can add a helper attribute so we need to specify attributes within curly braces helper let me set its value to clone now let us see how it appears 
refresh see a clone is getting dragged the actual element is remaining here and we are able to drag the element without getting any scroll bars now if you try to put it over here it will not be dropped why we haven't made this a droppable element so for that we need to make the cart this is the cart so the shopping cart needs to be a droppable element so for that dollar hash cart it is a droppable element so droppable we need to write what should happen when we drop the element what actually should happen the items should be added within this ordered list so for that let me write let me add the drop event drop on drop what should happen function here event comma ui and inside this we need to write what actually should happen we should add the items to the ordered list so for that we need to first find dollar hash items we need to append that is the method to add the items so append what we should append we have to append dollar inside this let me close this first append okay and inside this we need to add li and close li and as its text what should be the text of this one it should be ui dot the dragged elements text so draggable dot text that should be the item added to the li okay it is items append not hash it is dollar li close li and as its text we need to add the dragged elements text so ui draggable dot text now let us see whether it is working or not refresh let me try to drag it see this has been added as the first element now let me try to add a toy this has been added as a second element next toy 3 again say book 3 like this we can just drag the elements into our shopping cart so what we have done let me just explain it again i have added reference to the jquery ui files i have created an jquery ui accordion actually you can just create a list of elements but for more clarity i have provided i have added a div element and inside that i have added two different sections that is one section for books and another for toys and we have made it an accordion so we have used the accordion method now next we need to make each of these list items draggable for that for easy referencing we have provided a class name to the ul so that you do not have to add the class name for each of the list items so we have added the class name to the ul and then dot source dot li so that the list items will become draggable we have made it draggable using draggable method and we have added the helper attribute so that the scroll bars will not be created and a clone of the item will be dragged then we need to make the cart that is the shopping cart div a droppable element so that we can drop these items into the shopping cart we have made it a droppable element using droppable method and to see the added elements we have attached the drop event handler and added all those items to our ordered list using the append method and the ui.draggable.text 
Thus, we have created a basic interface of a shopping cart using jQuery UI, droppable and jQuery UI, draggable interfaces.